Asuka, the Spanish word for sugar. And good morning, and welcome to another beautiful day here in Chile. We've got a busy day today, but I wanted to start up by flying my drone around and showing you what mornings look like here in Linares. It's really, really foggy for two reasons. One, because we're in a little valley and the water just naturally rises. And two, is because everyone uses the wood for a wood fire to heat their houses. And so it smells, Actually, not that bad. I don't really mind it. Some people do, but I really don't mind it. There's a dog right here. I really don't mind it much at all. However, uh, some people do, and uh, to me, it reminds me of going camping every single day. But that's what that fog was, the two things. And, uh, well, it's time to get some stuff done because we've been gone for three weeks now, and we're finally back. We've got to get stuff done, so. First step, step number one. I was all out. And the next step is going to this building right here because we have to find a new place to live. Uh, Dueño, our owner of the house, he will, we have to find a new place to live. The issue is that we don't have our carnet yet. We had our one year carnet but we applied for our five-year residency here a year ago in August. So almost one year ago, exactly. And still, nothing has come in and we're still waiting. So we have to go to the Gobernación. The problem with that is that we can't buy a car, so we can't find a place that's far away from the transportation here because you need to have the license and you need that car not to do blah, 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 blah. And the second thing is that you can't even look at buying a house here because you need to have that carnet. And I'm sure that there are different like weird ways to do it, but it's so much easier if you just have that carnet, that residency. Also, we can't have internet. You can't go to get a cell phone or internet without your residency. So, I'm gonna go to the Gobernacion, take that off the list, and hopefully, Hopefully, they have some news for us. I doubt it. Nothing has happened. Absolutely nothing has happened. Like I said, we applied in August of last year. It was approved in October. And our papers were sent in in April. Papers sent in in April, everything set. But unfortunately, Elise is going to the bathroom. <laughs> it's locked. And back to the realtor. All right. so. That went meh, because um, Linares is growing. The city is growing like crazy. There are tons of new houses being built here, and a lot of people are coming here to work. So that means that the cost of houses goes up, and the amount of houses goes down. So uh, they're going to look for a house for us and hopefully find something in the next 10 days so that we can find a place to live. One thing that I've missed here in Chile is the bread and the paper and porotos con riendas. One of my favorite meals in the winter. Absolutely delicious. Unfortunately, they didn't have anything gluten-free for at least. So, she's eating carrots. I think it's a little hilarious, like, after the fact. Maybe not so hilarious for her, but She's eating <laughs> That was a delicious meal for two of us. Minus one, but delicious brotos. Mm -mm. Trying to find something for Elise to eat. Anyways, it's been really fun to walk around Linares today. It's the first day being back here in Linares, and I think we've met maybe 
at least 10 people who have seen my YouTube videos who are super excited, including a group of young girls who were very, very giggly today to meet me, which just makes my day. It's so much fun. So if you do see me wandering around Linares, be sure to say, hey. off for a quick run. See you in a minute. Workout done. I added some water to my face to look like I did a little bit more than that. But I did do a workout. I did run. I promise. I promise. But now the water is running into the sweat and going into my eyes. Ah. I feel like there's a plan in all of this, in moving to a new house, in Elise eating carrots for lunch, in not getting our residency for almost an entire year. I'm sure there's a reason for it and it'll be okay. It's really not that big of a deal. But hope you guys enjoyed the video for today. If you did, please give it a big old thumbs up. I enjoyed meeting, I would say, 15 to 20 people today just walking around Linares. Thanks for saying hi. Continue to say hi if you see me on the streets. And we'll see you guys next time for another adventure. But for now, enjoy the views and ciao, Pascal.